Hi and welcome! In this video tutorial we will show you how to do basic editing in Scorecloud. Here is a song made from a recording. Firstly, this recording was analyzed into a bass clef and I would like it to be in the treble clef. So I start by double clicking on the clef and changing it. I would also like to view the score in 4-4 time, so I double click on the time signature to change that as well. When working in normal mode, you can use your mouse to grab a note and move it to the right or left to change the timing. And up and down to change the pitch. Holding the ALT key while dragging left or right changes the note duration, but it can only be prolonged up until the next note. And holding the ALT key and dragging up and down will move the note in half steps, altering the note. But I don't want to do this in this case, so then I use the shortcut COMMAND or CONTROL Z to undo. If you want to move a section, either you can click on a beat or drag over an area, like this. And then you simply grab the selected area and move it to where you want to. To undo, Command or Control Z. If you want to copy and paste an area, you select the area and hold the ALT key while dragging. You can also use the regular command or control C and V. Select an area and copy, and then select somewhere else in the score and then paste. You can also use the arrow keys to quickly step through your notes and change the pitch using the up and down arrow keys. Pressing delete removes a note, creating a rest. Deleting a rest will prolong the previous note. Holding the ALT key and deleting the rest will prolong the next note. Keyboard shortcuts can be found in the help panel and in the score cloud menus. You can also find a detailed list of shortcuts at the support section on our website. A really efficient way to insert your music into a score in Scorecloud is the beat by beat input. In normal mode, open the virtual piano from the window menu or use an external MIDI keyboard. Select up to four beats the selected section will get a red border. Play new notes to replace the old. Beat by beat editing can be very fast and can also be used to write a song from scratch. We have another video where this method is explained in depth. Please check it out. Another great feature in Scorecloud is the Rhythm Changer. Select a beat or an area with two or more notes. Go to the Actions panel and click on Rhythm. Here you find possible rhythmic options and combination for the selected notes. So, these are common ways of editing score. Please give it a try and see how it goes for you. And there are many other ways of editing, and even if your recording results in a strange looking score, it can usually be fixed by a little bit of editing.
Thank you for watching and see you soon.